Hi guys, um, I just want to give you an update on uh, my uh, refrigerator that uses the W, I'm sorry, XWFE filter. Uh, this is a GE refrigerator. Uh, the filter you have to change every six months, even if you don't use the refrigerator that much, uh, because there's a chip in the filter that will recognize how long the filter has been in, and then you have to replace it. This whole thing is about $50. So every six months you have to pay about $50 to uh, change the filter. If you don't, uh, in my refrigerator, if you push the filter status, it will show you zero, means that it's out of you know lifespan. And if you get water, the filter will become red. <clears throat> so the filter is from that spot. Uh, the one I have right now is a so-called a bypass filter you can get from GE. Actually, they uh, send one to us uh, for free. You just give them the model number and your, uh, your serial number. They can send one for you for free. I think it's a 1-800-GE-CARES. Uh, now, you take the filter out, you can do the bypass, but then the water will not be filtered. So what I did was I bought a, I think it's called Aqua filter you can get from Amazon. Uh, you have to just uh, simple, simple, very simple installation. They give you all the uh, parts uh, for attached to your fridge, and then you can just use your um, um, external filter in the back of the fridge, and that filter lasts for five years or five hundred five thousand gallons of water. Uh, so this is really going to be saving a lot of money. Uh, then I took this wrapping off uh, from the filter. Uh, just want to see what exactly is under that to for the machine to recognize uh, what it is. So if you can see, there is some circuit in the back of the wrap. Here's the wrap. Here's the circuit. This is a uh, kind of like a, your ID. You go through a parking lot or something. Um, this is the uh, N uh, near field. Uh, I, feel, I forgot a word. Is NFC or something? Uh, basically, there's a circuit that will tell the fridge um, uh, how old your filter is, and it's uniquely um, uh, identifiable by the uh, refrigerator. Therefore, if you take it off and put the same thing back on, it's going to tell you it's an error. It, it won't even get water, dispense water from the fridge. So I think it's something that you can only use one time. Now, if you can maybe use on a different refrigerator it's a possibility but just a hassle to do that kind of a trick in a uh, hack i think the probably easiest way just get a bypass filter you can get free from uh g one hand ge cares just want to order parts and tell them that you want to get a bypass filter and of course you know they'll send one for you for to you for free and um or you can get it from amazon then of course you have to pay for it i think it's 30 dollars um, either way, once you have the bypass filter put in, it also has a chip in there so that the refri refrigerator will recognize it's a bypass filter so it will never complain that your filter is out of date. Uh, hope it helps.